Hi guys, so we finally have an update huh? timer announced in Discord about... It was actually quite a while ago. It was actually 7 in the morning for me. Oh my god. I was live for so long, goddamn. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> anyway, so update is in less than 7 hours as of recording this video right now. Well, at least the shutdown is. So, we do have an update confirmed for later in the evening or midnight, depending on where you are. So, in this video, we're going to talk a couple of things you guys should definitely do before the update comes. Now, trust me, guys, it is not too late. You still have time to prepare all that stuff that I'm going to tell you. So, don't really stress about it. But anyway, last night, I got a very, very small part of the developer Q&A that they hosted or whatever. And I heard that it was going to be 11 new units. So, safe to say... You guys are gonna need a lot of heavy rolls. 11 units, I would say probably 6 or 7 of them probably gonna be banner units. Maybe there's gonna be a new portal unit, maybe like a new secret unit or something, and then maybe just a couple of evils. So if 11 units is true and all of them are coming, well, assuming that was not the OPM update, take this with a, a grain of salt, right? It might have been the OPM update, but I think it was this update that's coming uh, later today, I had 11 units. Might be the Omega update, but I don't think so. I think it's gonna be today's update. So yeah, um, on this update, we are gonna have a lot of new units. So make sure you guys farm a lot, a lot of emeralds. Now, um, you guys know how to farm emeralds. Basically just go to story, go to one one, and you guys know the drill. It's fairly, fairly simple how to do it. There is a lot of uh, tiny task videos. I have one myself in case you don't know how to do that. Go ahead and watch that video but yeah it's basically just using yummy or any other like chip unit well now we have a lot of chip units like minato can do it actually i don't know if minato is a good choice but angel can definitely do it even boa can do it doesn't really matter you guys probably know the drill anyway but next thing that i want to talk about which is a little bit more important you guys know that uh well actually if you watch the development q a you would know this question was asked by somebody and it had to do in regards to info materials. Somebody asked specifically if those spirit shards will be used. And the answer was yes. So you can expect those spirit shards to be used again in an evolution. So the thing that I would highly suggest you guys to do, highly, highly, is go ahead and AFK the challenges whenever you can. Now, keyword is whenever you can. Basically, the only thing that you need is, well, Water Park, which is the Cuban challenge, can definitely be AF cable, definitely, but it is a little bit of a harder tiny task because like you spawn kind of far off the map in the middle of the sea and then you just have to use your arrow keys to turn like that and then you have to like press W, but it's not very consistent, at least for me, it, like when I made my tiny task, it worked like two, three times in a row and then it broke. So it's really not that consistent. So what you really are aiming to find is uh, a desert village challenge. As soon as you find one, just hop on and AFK that. Since desert is like very, very, very damn easy to the tiny task. Because the good thing about desert is like since you already spawn like halfway through the map or well, not even halfway, like at the beginning, you have you don't need to move which means that you can make like a better version of a time task where you don't have to record the entire run and whatnot because recording the entire run is kind of what uh, causes problems because sometimes like the run finishes earlier and then you rejoin then there's also like uh, the loading in lag and stuff like that so desert eliminates that because of the fact that you can just like record a version of yourself just um Place this, place that, upgrade, and then press the retry button, and then you just like loop this file again and again and again, which is only like a few seconds long. So yeah, um, as soon as you find that desert village, just jump in it. So as you can see in the video as well that I've been playing, this is basically just uh, the tiny task that I did last night. I actually found a desert village speedy, and ironically enough, I wasn't even waiting for it. I just went to challenge last night before i hit the bed and it was like desert village speedy which is also the ideal one by the way because uh, since the mobs run faster you kill them faster you save like a whole bunch of seconds and throughout the span of the entire night that really adds up obviously it's not like that important like you you don't need speedy but it is another bonus like you're squeezing a couple more runs and as you can see after like the overnight i have 35 rico got ice 44 curse fingers and 83 spirit shards so i would highly advise you guys to go for those spirit shards if anything even if they're not used this update which i'm 100 sure that it will be evos this update 
that will be used on the next update for sure on the OPM update. And yeah, since it's been confirmed that they will be used again, you know, it's something that you just need to do. Now, there is a bunch of other stuff that I want to show you guys, and I don't know if they're actually related to this update even though this update is a jojo's update it is still a mini update it's not like a major theme update so there is a very high possibility that we could be seeing some uh, other units being added into the game now here's what i'm talking about if you guys check out this unit this guy right here is stark coyote stark if you pay attention do not get fooled by the horns and the wings the horns and the wings are essentially blessings um, they're adding like stuff to blessings. Could it be Overlord? Could it be something else? I actually have no idea. I haven't like thought about it that much. But yeah, this is like Stark from uh, Bleach, obviously. So could we potentially see a Bleach update in the future where we get to Evo or Kiora? Who the hell knows? Maybe. Um, apparently this is Thor's code unit. Another code unit for Thor. I don't know. That's what Blam said in his video. And what do we have here? Isn't that the same guy? No, that's actually not the same guy. Um, if you guys... Wait, is that the same guy? Oh, that is the same guy. Never mind. So that is Stark again. And this is also another new unit. This is from One Piece. Uh, her name is Miss Love, apparently. Oh, Blam shot her in her video as well. So could she also be coming in this update? We don't really know. So maybe like this is an update with like, a whole bunch of like random-ass units. Obviously centered around JoJo's, but maybe there's like three four judge units and then like a bunch of like other random ones until like the opm update is released but yeah if what i said earlier is actually true guys and if there is actually 11 units in this update we're gonna be pretty busy until i assume the next saturday where the opm update will be releasing finally the big uh update which was supposed to be actually update like uh, one or update two whichever way you want to see it um a month later but doesn't matter i guess hopefully that thing is done by next Saturday. It will be so good if like they actually drop an update on Saturday. It'll be good for uh, the game itself and all the players subsequently. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, just keep an eye out on challenges. We obviously have a lot of hours left until uh, the game goes down for maintenance. Like it's six and a half hours or so. Like I think challenges shift every 30 minutes as far as i was told i'm not entirely sure but uh, i was told that uh, they cycle every 30 minutes so yeah wait is it a different one or oh, it's the same one okay well it is 4 23 pm for me right now so i guess if it does cycle every 30 minutes it's gonna be like seven minutes from now that probably makes more sense as well right but yeah just keep an eye out on challenges and if you see a desert one just go ahead and fk it even bare bones shouldn't really be an issue um I personally just did it with Yami and Sukuna, but I'm pretty sure a lot of other combinations do most definitely work. Just use your best units, I guess. But yeah, just go ahead and farm like those spirits, so like they will be useful sooner or later. I was also thinking about farming um, these Lamy items, but I think they're only probably used for uh, Nami herself. I, even if like they add this Miss Love unit, and even if she has an Evo, I don't think she's gonna be related to yeah, Lamy items, so yeah, but anyway, we do have a new story, so I am fairly convinced that we will have a new Evo, because new story, they're probably gonna add some new materials in, or maybe they just save it for next week, like, you know, a special, like, randomized unit that is gonna be dropped, but yeah, anyway, guys, that was pretty much it, so two main takeaways out of this entire video, five challenges, if you can, if you find a desert village, or if you don't, just, like, if you are playing manually, just still farm some challenges, like, get your shards, you know, it's better if you have everything ready beforehand than doing it later on. Farm some uh, emeralds if you don't have. Like, if it is 11 units this update, it is going to be a lot of rolling. Although, it might be the next one, actually. As I said, I'm not entirely sure whether the 11 units are for this update. Although, I think I, I think I, it was for this update. And yeah, also, if you guys really, really, really feel like, like doing stuff, you might as well just go ahead and farm for the... Or Kiora unit, this one, because uh, as you guys saw from the Stark sneak peek, there might be a Bleach update, mini update soon, and uh, Okiora Evo might drop sooner than later. And I have a feeling that Okiora Evo is gonna be actually a really good unit, like even the legendary unit, well, secret, is still good. So, yeah, um, in case you're wondering how to do it, I do have a video on how to actually AFK farm uh, 
or Kiora Evo, so you can go ahead and watch that video. But yeah, anyway, guys, I'll see you guys later tonight. I'll be live streaming the update, obviously. We're gonna be working on all the showcases and stuff like that. But yeah, anyway, as always, if you guys have enjoyed, I'll catch you guys all on the next video. Peace out.